he comes in, then he wants to put that in. Then he wants to even secure space inside the frame, then he can pass my gun, all right? So the first thing, I don't want to freeze me on the map. So when it comes in, you see, I make the reversal here with tempo. See, and then I slide my shape in. So this is the first step, right? Here. Once I set up the position, right, like an issue, it's pretty difficult for me to twist me on the mat, right? Here. The other option, I can reinforce my back with my right hand here. See, now it's pretty difficult for him to twist me, right? Then I want to escape from this position, right? Before I do, I will block past that shoulder. The other I have an issue on his hips, I'm free to pull my right leg out. So from this position, you see? Here, I suck my right leg. Then I set this tie, right? Once I do so, I have access to do the reverse hip escape. That's the first escape, you see? As soon as I do, I step this tie, and then I do reverse hip escape. As soon as I come up in front of him. By the time I come back, I will make the angle to serve the better hip. I need to be sideways by the time I do this technique, you see? I want to use my shin, that is a parallel to the floor, right? If my knee is point of seal like this, he can do fire space. It's even easy for him to make me flat as well here. Then I'm in trouble. So I need to stay sideways. See? This position. My shoes are really tight on him, right? He cannot even find a space to cut from this position. See? Here. Then once I set up, I cut the far side shoulder, like blocking the shoulder here, right? And then pull my knee up. Then I cannot even pull my knee out towards this side. You see? I'm even blocked. Or I'm going to move my leg below my knee, here, this, right? I completely stop the knee slide, right? Now I need to recover the position. It's pretty difficult for me to push my leg this time, you see? He's leaning on me completely, right? I cannot push it away, right? Or I'm going to change the angle, right? I use my right hand, right? I do the reverse hip escape. As soon as I come back in from him, look. As soon as I change the angle, you see? I can find a space to set up the here. And then I recover the position. Okay, next one. He already puts his knee on the mat like this, right? That means I cannot pull my leg out. You see? Here. So I want to make another frame with my left arm. Like making a car grip, right? So first I want to explain about how to make a car grip on this side. See? I'm gonna grab the car out of here, you see? That is below his collarbone level, right? So my goal is not use my left arm to push my leg, right? I wanna use his lapel to push, okay? So I grab the side of his lapel here. Once I make, see? I wanna use this part to push his neck. See, this is how I push my leg, right? So that's why I need to grab a little lower, right? If I grab higher than the collarbone level, you see, I cannot, Use this color, right? Then I have no leverage. So here, see? And then I push, right? As I can use his lapel, it's not comfortable for him, right? Even though he tries to drive his leg, you see? He's choking himself. Then I can make the maximum leverage as well, right? I even have an issue here. So that's why he cannot cut in, right? He cannot do the knee side pass. So once I set up this type of frame, I can even crash him to come to the gallop pass, right? And that's the time I recover the position. You see here? Right, when the time he slides out, look how he makes the space, right? The way that he wants to get close to me, you see, he's gonna change his base. By the time he change, I just wanna pull my leg out. And then, I recover the position. So he cuts in, this, you see? He already puts his knee on the mat like this, you see? I just wanna retreat with the knee shape here, right? I don't even need to get close to him here. I even lean back, see? I'm changing the angle, right? My chest is getting away from me. That means he's getting away from the guard pass. See? I make the one more frame. I grab the collar here. See? By the time I grab the collar, I want to make sure that I put my thumb down here. Not going like this. See? Otherwise, I cannot use his lateral properly to push him away. I grab around here. And then I use the side of the collar. Not this part. You see? Here. I, I can even get sideways like this. I'm not gonna put my left shoulder on the mat. Like this. You see, I stay sideways, right? As if I play the half girl. Then once I set up, I even catch him to get out, right? As soon as he slides out, I can find a space to pull my right out. And then I recover position.
Okay, this time it's free bash situation, right? As I feel a lot of pressure, right? I want to do the same as the last one here, right? So I just want to escape from this position as if I were resetting a position. So instead of waiting for him to come to me, I want to move myself, right? Once I set up the frame, like the last one, you see, knee shift against his hips, then making the frame with his collar, right? I want to cover with my elbow. This time it's very important to change the angle, you see? I'm in this type of angle, right? I'm not staying in front of him like this, see? Otherwise, he may be reach, yes, this, right? He can even find a space to get a leg swing pass like this as well, right? This can be another problem. So that's why I need to get my up body away from him. So as soon as I set up, I lean back here. Now it's pretty difficult for him to reach my collar, right? He can even find a space to the leg swing pass as well. So here. Okay, next, I want to come out with my elbow, right? But this is no space here, right? Look at off my elbow here. This is how to sit up escape, right? I use my elbow to sit up here. Then, once I set up, I'm going to push myself away to cramp of distance, see? During the time I do, I want to keep him away with the car here, see? And then, once I'm ready, I push myself away, look, here, see? Now, I'm not going to go down to the floor. I want to sit up, right? Once I do, I scoot my hips forward and then I reset the position. You see? It becomes so hard like this, right? In that case, I make the car grip. You see? My head is big down. You see? This. And I lean back. As soon as I lean back, you see? I have a space to post my elbow over there. But this time, you see, I'm not going to post my elbow around here. That is the around my head. Here, see? I will get belly down. That's the way easier for me to sit up, right? This, see? As long as I keep the frame, he cannot get close to me, right? Next, I'm gonna push myself away, look. See, during a time I have momentum, I can sit up, 